The topic today, do young, beautiful Ukrainian women living in Europe need help to find a husband? And um, this topic I bring for you. And Joe really wanted me to release this topic for you so I can share you uh, my experience, my like real time life experience. And um, so how to begin, how to begin. Why uh, actually like why I uh, personally joined the uh, magic guarantee. So while this war, I um, decided to stay in UK and here in UK, I came alone and I don't have like a husband back home. I don't have any children and I'm just still 25. I'm still like was doing my career back home in Ukraine, was living my best life, very uh, easy life for me and uh, was happy with this, with my friends, with my uh, job, with like daily life. And of course, I dated like some guys. Then I went outside of Ukraine, obviously because of war. And uh, like, I uh, first of all, I just been waiting for war, war finish, and that's all. I waited in Germany in refugee camp. And uh, when I realized like war keep going, I need to do something with my life, and I need to find a job for myself because I lost lost my job, and. Uh, I uh, also decided, like, uh, um, I'm going to UK because UK program started later. As I can speak English, and that's so the main reason. And England more close by to Ukraine. And then I came to UK, and I settled down a bit, uh, found a job, and um, living here like with a family, getting used to this culture, getting used to this mentality. Uh, and uh, then uh, the story began. Like I, I decided. Oh, I really interested. Like uh, interested to maybe have some um, relationship. Maybe this will be friendly relationship. Maybe maybe this will lead me to the dating <laughs> and to the like um, romantic relationships. Then I started and uh, registered with uh, Tinder. If you know this website, I'm not doing like a promotion here, but I just sharing my story uh, because I uh, used to do this uh, and register with Tinder in Ukraine back home. And uh, on Tinder, I met uh, some um, several very nice people, which I'm still in connection and we are like nice friends. And one of the person I've been in a romantic relationships and we're still in connection and this person due to or helped a lot to my family and uh, yeah so I decided okay let me try it here and how it's going uh, so I also tried it and um, I've met um, not many guys I've met uh, in real I mean uh, like to real meeting uh, some conversation like uh, lead to maybe I had three real meetings and uh, what I see what I can say like I see that guys like me and uh, I can say like uh, they was lovely but there is some uh, things I don't know it's about ment uh, mentality different uh, nation so I'm seeing like they started to be more, uh, they tried to go to relationship, a romantic relationship with me more quickly than we know each other. And they started to talk very fastly about the sexual topics and how they like me. And this has actually made me very confused. And then I realized like even speak at work about this with my colleagues. And I see like, mm, there is different mentality and uh, guys more open and I think uh, actually like this society more open for such topics and they are doing this more quickly and girls more desperate for it and I'm very like different girl and they they made me like uh, they like me I've been like oh he is okay we can still meet like I kind of like him and they trying to deserve my hard by this kind of attraction to me and showing their sexual attraction very like hard and so this is nice I tried to explain like oh this is too quick for me and I'm from very different society and for me this is very strange 
and uh, this happened not one time and it's why like i see that something like very different uh, different going on here and what i think and what i see as we doing this channel for you guys and we explaining you ukrainian culture and our ladies and what our mentality and what how we think and how we go into relationships and we're not going easily to relationship with anyone we met or anyone who just interested in us and this is was just my first experience and after this i decided like oh this is actually like i see that this not working for me i closed this uh, like i closed the uh, tinder profile and uh, i closed like um, some who write me to social medias i decided to skip this for a while because i'm seeing that most of my uh, age guys they are just interested in such fun and then i uh, realized myself like wow <laughs> i don't know really how to meet a uh, right like quality person who will share my mindset or at least will try to understand my mindset and then much currency happened in my life and uh, i uh, after i made some live streams i've been thinking like uh, this is very nice because community here really understand and at least want to understand what ukrainian woman why is are different what is difference and really respect this this is the most important because understand it's understand okay i can explain it to uh, like two guys here but they don't respect this or they just not used to it and here is ladies say very actually like active in relationships and it's also very big difference that um you know like a feminism and uh, i'm not saying like just directly like feminism uh position going in this country but most of i'm seeing that women in a uh, woman rights higher and men just really like afraid of saying something uh and this is like very different it makes men and woman role and relationships very different and i see here woman uh, role more active in relationships than a man role and it's why like uh, women as well they really like interested and first of all they're interested about um, not about marriage not about this just for having fun or use uh, um, try this experience with guy and that's all so very different mindset and i thought like oh this will be very hard for me and then i just give up <laughs> and then yeah with much guarantee i seen that here is uh, some guys who really want to learn about ukrainian culture and about uh, difference and what is like traditional country but not like where everything forbidden it's more like about modern independent traditional country and i like this like it's like a golden middle for me our ukraine and our traditions and uh, for me it become obvious that uh, through the match guarantee i probably can meet the person uh, with a mindset i would like and who will be respect my mindset and uh, will be like a good quality like husband for me not just like a um, partner for a night or how people live in here uh, and seeing relationships here so for me this is very different and it's why yeah then i joined the match guarantee and see that uh, intentions in the in the beginning of relationships when you just meet some people random people in your life um it's very like hard to meet the uh, right person with right intentions or this will take time and this is also like a reason why i decided to join match community because like i'm sure i'm sure i can meet someone who will respect my vision but it will take time and i'm still uh, like <laughs> have this opportunity as a match guarantee so yeah i decided to join i decided to try like my luck in this um agency and uh, after this i can say you like i waited for a while uh, no one responded me just i've been 
waiting and uh, then I had some man uh, who sent me a request who was interested in me and uh, the point is for now that the man was from USA and I'm actually in UK and I choose UK because of this close to Ukraine and for now it's very hard for me to tell I'm very not sure about my future I'm very like even for now I feel and I want to go back home <laughs> and this is the point uh, that I'm not ready to use this chance from this guy to go to USA because I'm not ready to go to that far to USA so yeah I got the messages and requests for uh, no uh, for from a guys who want to know me but they are uh, two guys like from USA and I um, um, decided to sincerely answer um, to the company that uh, I really like these profiles and I would like to meet these people but I'm not ready to move so far away right now I'm still right now like moved to different country and still not sure like <laughs> if I'm staying here what I'm doing and uh, not sure about my life and this war makes uh, so much brings so much stress and uh, <laughs> ruining all your life plans and uh, it's why I just said like uh, sincere that I would like to meet someone here in UK I can meet and I'm still here so I need a partner who will be close to me or who we can live this time like together if we share same vo values if we share same mindset uh, so yeah this is also very important for me and what I requested and uh, I understand it so also can take a time and um, mostly match guarantee clients it's uh, USA clients and this is what for this part of life when already there is so big changes in my life I'm not just ready mentally for that big change in my life to move that much abroad and uh, I just feel this will make me will put me in a very big stress so I'm really like open for uh, dating but for a uh, territorial <laughs> dating uh, here in UK or uh, after uh, I can meet with other guys if uh, war in Ukraine finish and um, I'll be back in Ukraine and Mitch guarantee still will bring some uh, foreigners to Ukraine and we can meet we, we can have proper uh, proper connection so maybe also this gonna work but not like for now as I see and it's why as well like Mitch guarantee having um, not like uh, hard times with me just uh, I have some specific request it's true um, but yeah this is kind of like my experience and the main point like why young and beautiful Ukrainian women need help it's about just save their time save their stress level and uh, find find the man who already know their uh, uh, culture and uh, have a real intentions and uh, I think this is very important. So, yeah, this is just my story. Today, it's completely free for you to have a video date face to face with beautiful Eastern European women of all ages and walks of life. So, I, I brought flowers. Wow, it's so beautiful. With makeup or no makeup, hair up, hair down, you always look great. Thank you. You get to ask all your deepest burning questions. Okay, so we will see you live over at ukrainedating.tv.